He's a big boy. Is he though? It is. It is my favorite boy, dare I say. Oh, my first magma cream. Let's go. Can you like and subscribe? Yeah, the problem is there is like a guy standing in the middle of them all, which is kind of scaring me. Uh, how's it called? That was uh, what are they called? The funny, the funny people. Piglin? Man. Zombie piglin? Yeah, zombie piglin. Zombie piglin. Yeah, he was just kind of standing around making sure that I couldn't really attack a magma cube. He's just standing there menacingly. True based. Wait, there's a second magma cube? I got even hungrier when he heard about the se second magma cube. I mean, magma cubes are like my... I guess I like normal cubes more, but the slimes are like my favorite enemy in Minecraft, I think. They kinda look delicious, not gonna lie. <laughs> I don't think that's... Uh, you know what, you're so right, Dave. They kinda look like a delicacy. True, man. I think magma cubes are just like the most useful mob because of everything they can do. Magma cubes or regular cubes? Magma cubes. Why? What I don't can know. they do that others can't? They just have like the best things. Like. Nice. Uh, uh, what do you call it? Uh, <sighs> the thing, the stuff, uh, the uh, pistons. Sticky pistons, or... But that's, oh, that's not macro cubes, that's just regular cubes. Yeah, but I mean all the cubes. They got like... Uh, fire oh. resistance, they got the, the sticky pistons. You know, they put Isn't like all the cheating? important stuff. If you just see all the cubes, I mean, there's different types. But it would be like, you know, it's, it's saying that mm -hmm. horses or all mammals are great, but there's like horses which... It can be turned into food and ridden, and then there's other animals that can't be ridden. What is your point now? You say all slimes are great. Yeah. They they not all. They're, they're diff there's a difference between the slime. They're I mean, yeah, but it's like, I don't know, a golden retriever and an Alaskan Malamute. Are they both great dogs? Yeah. They're both yeah, great. but you can't just dogs say dogs are, are great. You can't just say dogs are great. I mean, yeah, you not can all say dogs that. are equal. Have you ever seen the, the small little chihuahua? They they small and nothing worth worthless small. The thing is, I feel like most of the bad chihuahuas are bad because their owners just suck. So I'd say chihuahuas are okay, just their owners are shit. No. You know, I do say yes to that. Honestly, small dogs are usually just worse, even if they have good owners. Nah, with good owners, uh, small dogs can be good too, I feel like. I know a lot of good owners with bad small dogs. I know a lot of bad owners with bad small dogs, and I know two good owners with two good small dogs. Um, so for me it kind of the, the theory is accurate for my experience let's call it that damn bro is making a theory a game theory it is more a dog theory which is kind of more hype but sure go off i guess oh my god imagine if they made dog theory a real channel <laughs> that would actually be kind of hype i would watch that <laughs> you know not animal theory or anything nah dog theory Man, dogs are just great, what can you do? And they could also make a cat fury channel that could make like versus events, like cats versus dogs. And then the dog fury channel talks about what the dogs do good and the cat fury what the cats do good. So it's basically like one of those old collabs where they like this game versus that game, but it's just both times the same person. Kinda. I guess. <laughs> Hi, it's man. like the it's like the noob versus pro versus god versus hacker. True, true, man. I just think it's so funny that like 
new versus pro makes sense and then there's always like hacker or god and that's always like the best player even though hackers are like the worst players yeah i mean the hacks are also often obvious at least yeah and even if they're not if you use hacks it's just so stupid <laughs> Kind of, mostly, yeah. In a, like, in a multiplayer game. <clears throat> yeah, multiplayer games, definitely. I don't think there's any good excuse to use Hex there. But single, single player, player I, mean, I can see that. You can do whatever the frick you want. Yeah, especially if it's like a game which, you know, relies on you buying stuff or something. Which... Oh, yeah. True, true. Yeah, then I even know someone in this voice call right now who cheated. The question now is, who do you mean? That's what I mean. That's a good question. Yeah, we don't you know. talk about We don't talk about any games on this channel. Yeah, none where the word is repeated twice and also none where the other person none. might have done the same as well. Oh, oh yeah, I remember now. <laughs> Wait, did you not know what I was talking about? Oh no, I didn't know what you were talking about, but I didn't. I mean, uh, like, I remember what what's also happened with that. That also happened with another person. I mean, you know, who who wouldn't, honestly? Yeah, but still, like, I feel like cheating in games can be fun, especially if you've already beaten the game. Oh yeah, definitely. I mean, for, like, in a way, example, some mods are even cheating, depending yeah. on how far you take the meaning of cheat i mean there's this this uh this game called grand theft auto 5 yeah and i i just like to cheat in that game in the single play because it's fun yeah also they even added cheats they knew what they were doing <laughs> i mean yeah but they're like so stupid to access and they only last for a certain amount of time instead of for an infinite amount of time but like, I, I like to cheat in that game, give myself infinite ammo and invincibility and just start, you know, shooting at the, at the civilians. <laughs> I always, I always like did it that. against the police, but I guess we both have like, other preferences. I, li I like shooting civilians, it's so much fun, man. In uh, video games. <laughs> you know, whatever floats your boat as they say. Or like in Just Cause, I always love to uh, do the same thing, but with more creative ways, like launching people with slingshots. Yeah, I have a question. Is there any way to make like a uh, zombie piglin scared or attract them to something other than just, you know, making them angry? I don't think so. Pretty sure you can't do that. Why? Uh, because I want them to go away from my magma cube, so I can actually, you know, attack. Just attack while they're there, idiot. I am so scared of hitting them, though. That is my worst nightmare. In insert the SpongeBob meme where SpongeBob drives over a small hill on a roller coaster and screams because it's scary. Yeah, but you know, I'm... Uh, Spongebob didn't have like most of his gear with him. Ooh. Yeah, that would change things, wouldn't it? I recently saw a meme about that, which is like... The, the Splatoon 3 is dark... is one of the darkest games ever made. That was the YouTube title and then someone just puts the Spongebob gif underneath. You know, I, I would like to say let him cook, let him cook, you know. I just... You, we won't know until... Wait, the game's already out, right? You wouldn't know since you never played the game correctly. Let, let's just say that. I'm pretty confident. I never confident. beat the story mode of the game. And I never loved the story mode of the game. True, totally see. Not. It, was, it was not one of the best stories I've ever had in a video game. That's Even though it was, sad. like, stupid. Like, it was... It was a fun story, not a, you know, mm. big brain smart story. I mean, fun is all a story needs to be, in all honesty. True. Dave, have you been uh, home yet, or where are you? Uh, at the village right now, why? Oh, alright. No, no reason, I was just thinking. I was home quickly for some growing up of things. And I'm probably going to the end.